Okay, so in the last part we found the sort of safe haven in the City of the Dead, so we rested up there and we're going to continue on. And we ah. found, we found Hayden again. Hey, whatever his name is. Hayden. I met you at the inn. This appears to be the right, uh, a writer's room. A writer named Mage, presumably. There are many interesting books. For example, this is an account of Luran's fall. It appears monsters destroyed the town. Um, you can read in here, there's some interesting things in here, actually, so I'll just read them out. Misha took a book in his hand, here's a diary. A rare guest arrived today, a traveling monk. I think that could be. I was thinking that was the monk that was outside the front of Luran when we got here, actually. Yeah. Um, when told of fiends, he produced a single seal. The seal is said to protect oneself from ghosts. That's the seal we got just before, the holy seal. So what that monk did for us, he helped us out by making that seal. So that's kind of, that's, isn't that interesting? Isn't that nice? Isn't it? We just took a book in hand. It is the town's history. Surrounded by desert, Loran has never had much agriculture. But the precious gems that lay underground kept Loran alive. Loran grew to become a magnificent city like none other. But in recent years, misfortunes have befallen the city. Surrounding rivers suddenly ran dry and monsters began raiding the city. The book ended there. So yeah, those, those were the two books. So kind of interesting. It gives you a bit of history on like what happened to the town and also um, about that monk as well, which is kind of cool. Okay, I think that's it for the east side of town. I don't think we'll do anything else here. Um, I need to kill them. Because it's there, and he's in the way. Ah! Oh, see what I mean by slow down? When two of them do it? Yeah. Oh my god, that was bad. It does it on the actual SNES version, the SNES copy too, um, just so you're aware. Um, it's not just because of the computer ROM version. So yeah, it's kind of annoying. Ghosts! Oh, come on. I wasn't even in the room. That went Kelsey over. I'll try harder. <laughs> I don't remember what was in this room. Let's have a quick look. Ah, uh, yeah. Just a bunch of these douchebags. For some reason they have really good defense to the lunge attacks, but if you just poke them they tend to die. I don't know why that is. Anyway, well it's in here's a magic rock, I think. I don't think there's any armor in here. Is that it? I still call things macho macho man. <laughs> why? Because they get they attack you with a flurry of kicks. I want to be a macho man. Macho macho man. Catch up. Hey, you did first. Yeah, but it's my video. <laughs> you let me join in. So what? It's just because I'm nice doesn't mean you can contribute crappy singing. <laughs> it's good singing. Whatever you reckon. Yeah. That's right, die everybody. Mm. What? Killing all the townspeople. Uh, the, the zombies trying to eat me. They're trying to eat you. Now, see these people walking through that door there? That and the hint from before are your only hints. Oops. Are your only hints. They, they come back, thankfully. Anyway, that and the guy saying he wants to put a door in there before are your only hints. The only hints you receive. Man, I was stuck at this part for ages. You're lucky I already did this part for you, Ryan. I could tell you where to go when you were playing. Yeah, those are the only hints to let you know that you can walk down here. I was stuck there for so long, oh my god. <laughs> I don't even remember how I figured that out in the end. And they probably walked into a wall. I, uh, I think I was just randomly running around in desperation. Oh, bullcrap. It's impossible. It's so maniac. 
<laughs> that went well. I think you can go in here. Okay. Is there something in here? Oh, yes, there is. Why have people built the walls of chickens? I don't know, they all seem to have done it in every house. Oh, this is the bit where you need the holy seal. Can't get past these guys without it, so. Yeah. No, I don't think you can glitch past them. I don't think there is a glitch, sorry. I don't think so either. Why did it make you get an item that you only use once anyway? I don't know. It's not like. You have plenty of room for it anyway, it doesn't really matter. And you can't attack them while they're doing their flurry either, which is annoying. I didn't actually do that much in the third eye one. Well, I thought they were. It's because I'm over leveled. <laughs> Usually they hit you for like tens and twenties and stuff, depending on what your level is. Alright. Alright. Yeah. Now we're at the north side of town, which you'll remember was one of the sides of the town where they said they wanted to build more houses. And we've already we've, we've already been to the east side. Well there are actually houses here, which is weird. But yeah, I'll show you that thing from before. Is this still there? I don't think it is. I'll, do, I'll try it anyway. Ah, yes it is. Okay, I, you wouldn't have seen this before. Like, I only found this because I was YouTubing something and I happened to see it. And I was like, wow, I never knew that. <laughs> so, now I can show you guys as well, which is good. You me shout from the box. Bijou, some zombies are coming in here. Hurry, hide. Hiding under the table, with me, I'm a ninja. A stranger is among us today. I hear he beats us up the instant he sees us. Well, we shouldn't just take it. We better find and catch this person soon. What was that? There's a commotion outside. Why do you know so much for my break? Like real people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like. Hey, Bijou. Maybe the residents here don't realize that they are zombies? It's funny because they're like some guys running around beating us up. <laughs> like, yeah, that would be me. Hi, <laughs> how you doing? Sorry to interrupt your work shift or whatever you're doing here. I, come out from the table. I thought you were trying to eat me and kill me. Sorry about that. That's what it seemed like you were doing. You seemed to, you know, damage me when you touch me and stuff, so... Okay, now before I end this part, what I want to do, if I can find it. Right. Yeah, I want to show people where to train first. Um, where one of my training spots is. Large bulb! I don't know. Well, it's a large bulb, man. I think it's the first large bulb you can ever have access to. Large bulbs are the best bulbs in the game. Wow, how'd you hit twice? I don't know, but I liked it. <laughs> I'm trying to find where the graveyard is, I don't remember. I thought it was over here somewhere. I'm gonna have to recharge. That's right. Alright, yeah, it's over here. Okay. Now, this is where I train. Um, where I train to get levels up. It's one of my grinding places. It's a really quick place because there's an S load of zombies in here. Um, I usually train here till about level 21 or so. Really? Yeah. Something like that. So look at that, level up. Cheap. <laughs> Why is that cheap? It's one of the fastest places to train. So you'll want to train here. In the grave. Um, if you don't like grinding for very long. Um, yeah, before the part ends I will show you the grave. Remember before how um, we said Tenjamin should take his money to his grave? It says Tenjamin grave on the Tenjamin's grave on the stone. Something gleamed in the grave. Bijou obtained 500 gems. Oh, I thought that would be enough. 500 gems is pretty good. Now there's the dog, but I'm going to train here for a bit longer um, before I talk to the dog. Um, so what I'm going to do is pause this part here since we're right at the end of the video anyway, and I'll I'll train a bit before I continue on to the next part. And by the time we do that, there's a major rock in here too. Just for your information. By the time we do that, I'll be level... Uh, I'll, I'll get to about level 22 or so. Maybe 23, I don't know. Um, but yeah, see you then for the next part of the City of the Dead in Terranigma.
gonna kill you. No, they're not. 